WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, this is Larry Pesavetto for TFNN, the mid-afternoon update, but you certainly don't have to ask very much of what's going on today, folks, because uh, the only thing that's going down is the gold, which is really great because we were able to short that. But, boy, we've got some strong stock markets based on a odd uh, jobs number that even the holy mother in uh, – uh, the Vatican didn't even believe because it was 319,000 new jobs. I mean, that's just a, an incredible, incredible move. So, by the way, our, go, our guest is going to be at the trading. Hold on, folks. I've got a slight problem with the, um, uh, the beepers going off because I, we happen to be short some gold and it's going down and I have to change the price objective. So if you'll bear with me here just one small second, I'll get this fixed. Hopefully, and uh, there we will have it done here uh, right now. So, yeah, this is good. Okay, uh, it, we'll go through some of these trades a little bit later, but that's the main thing uh, I'm looking at today. I posted the chart here in the Tiger's Den is the giant three drive to a top pattern. Uh, we were looking to short the S&P at uh, 42.96, and it's been to 42.91 uh, so far. Uh, but that's one of the ones we've been able to uh, ca capture some nice moves in the euro. And, of course, we missed the soybean trade. But uh, when you look at all these markets across the board, uh, there's green everywhere for risk on, uh, except for Treasury bonds. They're down a full point, as uh, pretty much the Treasury notes are, as interest rates uh, are dropping uh, at least temporarily. Uh, the grains are strong again. Soybeans up another 16 cents. Uh, let's try that again, another 23 cents, and corn's up 7 and wheat's up 10. So we got some really big things happening in the inflation front, but that's neither here nor there. So we'll be covering some of these things as we go through our day-to-day. -day. But uh, our special guest today for my show on uh, Trade What You See, what's coming up next, will be Bob Miner of the Dynamic Trader. I've known Bob uh, well, well over 40 years, and uh so we'll have some fun talking to him. So live every day in an attitude of gratitude. And please stay with us for another segment here. we got one hour to go of some interesting markets. So we'll be right back. <laughs> 